Today I will be taming Andrew Sarkis. This is a mod of a ported creature from Fjorder in Ark Survival Evolved. Since it was the very last map that was released, and at this rate, who knows when this creature will even come back to Ark. So this mod will do just fine. First, you throw some honey down to briefly pacify it. Then, you jump on its back and play the mini game. Press left and right as indicated by the arrows on the screen and watch the red rage meter and be sure to jump off before it fills or you'll be bucked off and in trouble. Repeat until tamed. Now let's watch me try to tame an Andrew Sarkis. <laughs> Today we're going to get Andrew Sarkis. This mod is the port from Survival Evolved because you know what? After having Fjorder, I needed my Andrew Sarkis. I mean, when's the next time we're gonna get it back? Who knows? Unpredictable. So we're gonna leave our kitty cat up here, our marsupial creature, and we're gonna go try to do this. Now these Andrew Sarkis, I've seen them fighting in the wild and they are garbage. So I'm hoping that this guy is okay. Right. All right, minigame is the same. I just have to watch the arrows and the rage meter. This is the terrifying part. Come on. I'm not holding it down. I don't know why. Oh, oh fuck. Fuck. Okay, let's let him alone. Holy I don't even know where the hell I am. Okay, I still have honey on me. That was a scary experience, I feel like. There's just a lot of stuff to micromanage when you're looking at the frickin' screen. Holy hell. Okay, can I... I get him to get the honey. Like a freaking pig right there. Oh, we need to punch it. Get out of here, asshole. You're gonna try to get my honey. Ride it, boy! Ride it! Woohoo! Aim that hog! Oh my god, are we actually gonna get him? Oh, I'm so excited! Yes, just stay here. Getting mad as hell. Fuck! Little bitch! Just throw that honey on the ground. Fuck. Oh god! Holy hell, he came up for me. Oh. That was terrible. Well, ain't that a son of a bee? Don't, don't come up here, please. Dude, what are you trying to do?
Is he, is he good? Looks like he's still aggro as fuck. <sighs> Can you eat this honey? Stupid raptor. We were so close. Ugh. You still mad at me? Please don't be mad. Take that off. Okay, let's try again. This is horrible. I hope they didn't find my cat. Fuck. I don't see any hit markers, so I think we're okay. I have no idea where he is, by the way. Where she is, I don't know, I don't remember. <sighs> so close to the other one, I know it. Yeehaw! All right, we're getting it. We're getting it. Woo! I'm busting those rocks. They okay, were watching it. We're so close. Yeah! Yeah, pig! Big bear? I think we're gonna get him. So close! Don't tame in front of that one, please. We gotta get your ass out of here. Woohoo! Oh, I found Andrew something. Sarkis is a beast that's full of surprises. Helena! These ungainly creatures no! seem sluggish while foraging for a meal, but they can move unexpectedly fast when provoked. Like certain other whippomorphs, Andrew Sarkis will aggressively defend its territory against interlopers. With some distance between you, it may be possible to dodge a charging Andrew Sarkis. They don't exactly turn on a dime. Just don't expect a river or lake to protect you from one. As long as its feet can reach the bottom, Andrew Sarkis will plow its way right through deep water. These scavengers will tear into just about anything if hungry, but they've got a bit of a sweet tooth. I've seen many an agitated Andrew Sarkis pacified by some honey. Once tamed, Andrew Sarkis is a reliably fast beast of burden, as long as you don't need it to take any corners at full speed. Its density in water also makes Andrew Sarkis ideal for searching ocean floors for pearls, since it sinks so readily to the bottom. The preferred saddle design includes a mounted minigun to target foes, while the driver stays safe inside their airtight armored enclosure. Though a fully armored Andrew Sarkis can't absorb as much damage as some of the Ark's larger creatures, it still excels at harassing them. Amazing. Wow, look at all the Andrew Sarkis that just spawned here. Excuse? Okay, uh, we got the Andrew Sarkis. Thank you, Helena. 
He's 206. We actually need to find my Thyla because I feel safer on him. Where is he? Uh, I didn't give him a name. Thyla... Is it this one? Oh, it's not too far. Cool. Phew! Yeah, you definitely do not want to get chased in a straight line by these guys. Oh, look, at they're all down there. Huh, you know what? We need a female. Doesn't really matter what level. A higher level is nice. Let's get him from the dino ball. Check his little baby stats. Uh, hmm. 44 oxygen, I guess that's useful. These stats are kind of not good, not gonna lie. Let's get this one on here. Okay, so most of them are in here, which is fantastic. I've been having a hard time finding any because they come in like onesie twosie type shit. Oh, this is really good. Um, let's see, let's see. We need a female. Uh, there's only one female. Hmm. I mean, we could we could always change it up. Let's do this while I still have honey on me. Don't get stuck. Come on, bud, you can do it. My honey's gonna run out. Where is he? Bud, you want some honey? Yes. Uh, yeah! Yeah, pig! Don't run in any rafters. This is good. Don't be mad. Finding all the bear pigs. She's gonna get pissed. Run, bitch. Got more honey. It all. Oh, this is scaring me. Where is this guy? Five. All right, let's get back on him. Yeah, pig. Oh fuck! Raven tame bitch. Holy fuck! Oh god. We're not afraid of the Rex. Fuck that Rex. We're faster. We have more stamina. Watch, we're gonna go around this little hill and it's not even gonna fucking see us. Go to hell. <laughs> yep. Phew, okay, we got that mail. Just swap out gear and make it a girl. You know what I'm saying? That's just how it works sometimes. Hey. Hey, I need to get on you. Thank you. Okay, we're gonna go home. We're gonna make it a saddle. And then we're gonna ride that pig into the ocean. Alright, we're gonna break the entry sarcus because our rules are we can only use creatures we've bred or babies we've taken from the wild. So I think this is the one we want to turn into the mom. Here we go. Boom bam. Um, and then let's put them in the breeding. Make the baby! They're so tall and handsome looking. Get this hut off so I could actually see them. The fur could be refined a little more. It's very dodgy, but they still have all the color agents. And you know what? I might want to make 
Last time we did black and gold colors and I named one, um, uh, I think I named one Broomhilda and the other one, I can't remember his name. It was like something like gold. Oh, so long ago. Plus I don't have them anymore. <laughs> I completely deleted all of my, uh, all of Survival Evolved because guess what, it just takes up too much space. And I didn't really feel like going back and playing it. I might as well focus on the future. Anyway, we'll wait for her to have a baby and we'll raise up the baby and we'll take the baby out. I already made the saddle. It is right here. Oh. It has the minigun. I'm not gonna make bullets right now. We're just gonna go run around in the ocean. TBH. Okay, the baby's on the way. We got like five seconds. I'm so excited. This is going to be the one true son or daughter. Oh, I totally forgot that I set up the thing to pick him up. It's a boy. It is a one true son. Oh, he's a little tiny pig. Look at how chubby he is. Hold on. Let me get rid of this. Baby piggy. Chubby baby. Where's the berries? June, give me the berries. Yeah, give them the berries. I think they eat meat too, yeah? They're omnivorous. Yes. Consume, baby pig. Consume. Take some of these too. Do you like the meat? I don't remember if you eat meat. I think you do. Alright, this is little baby pig. Can't really see him. He's brown just like the floor. Little baby pig. Little baby pig. He's got funny little teethies. Look at those little teethies. The teethiest. Um, and we'll raise them up and then we'll go out and play. Okay, little baby boy wants to go for a little baby boy walk. So we're gonna have him follow me. And hopefully get that imprint. We'll see how much it imprints. Come on! Where are you at? Please don't fall down. There he comes. Oh, 92! Not bad! Look at you! Silly little guy. We'll have to wait another almost five minutes, but you know, whatever. All good. Honestly, 92 is probably good enough. Let's be honest. <laughs> Alright, we're here. Little Andrew Sarkis is so fast after the imprint. Holy hell! You love to see it. Let's see, are these the control? Okay. Control is for the minigun. Um. I'm gonna figure out. Oh, is it C? Oh yeah. I love it. All right. He stops on a freaking dime. How how about that? You know what? Our friend is going to need some more stamina. Give the stamina. Let's see how much damage he does. Probably not against a trike at the moment. So you know what? Screw it. Oh, I love that slide. Oh, I missed the slide. Oh, it's a 140 as well. Thank you! They really don't turn on a dime, do they? Ooh, 161! That's why we do the slide. Actually, let's go in the ocean. Oh god. Let's get out of the ocean. I can't remember. Trying to is it X? Oh, 
yup. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. Can we do the fast run underwater? He's a freaking athlete. Okay, it doesn't seem like we can. God, he's got oxygen for days. Uh, my oxygen is going down now, I'm drowning. I don't think that's right. Aren't we supposed to be protected inside? Or maybe I'm not actually in the thing. I did put it on while I was still mounted on him. Maybe that bugged it a little bit. Perfect. Okay, it's X. And we're running. Okay, it looks like we're safe. Yeah. Okay, we're for the wise. Make sure you put the saddle on when you're not mounted. Otherwise it bugs and you're still sitting on it, but you're not protected by the saddle itself. Hello. Oh, there's Megalodon right there. It's a shame we can't shoot this underwater. Did that shark see us? Eh, who cares? It's crazy. It's under the water like nobody's business. This is maximum stealth mode, by the way. Can you imagine just running around underwater on a injured sarcus and nobody can see you? Oh, cool, I kinda like it. You know what, this is kinda goes. Minding my own business. Not a care in the world. Dude, this Andrew Sarkis is like beast mode. Look at that oxygen. No, don't bother me. <laughs> Alright, time to go. Well, that was fun. Nice little dip in the water, eh? Let's give us a melee. <laughs> Aww. The little animation is the best. We're doing fat going fast enough for the little uh little boot scoot buggy. Yes! Best thing ever. It's already so fast. Oh, it's so brief. Oh god. That was an alpha raptor. Are we here now? Yeah, we are. Cool. Let's find the door. Please? Please. Can we jump in? Yeah, we can. Yay, we have an Andrew Sarkis. We might have to do Andrew Sarkis breeding. It makes me wonder when Aberration comes out how some of these creature mods are going to work. I already know how to use Andrew Sarkis in Aberration. Oh, it's amazing. I love it. I just wish the fur looked a little better. It looks a little bit wiry and not filled out very well, but yeah, I don't know. I don't know anything about Andrew Sarkis, like how to do mods and stuff. It would be nice to see another port that's a little more, you know, a little more. What can you say? But anyway, that's Andrew Sarkis. I'm pretty excited to have these guys on the map. They're omnivores that are pretty good medium-sized creature. And honestly, you don't need a saddle to ride them. You could just ride them bareback. Go wild. Go buck wild, you might say. Yeah. Yeah! Hey, 
Anyway, that's Andrew Circus. See you next time, and thanks for watching. <laughs> this video is sponsored by viewers like you. Thank you. And thank you so much to all of my coffee supporters. If you would like to support the channel just a little bit more, go ahead and visit my coffee page. Link is also in the description.